What's going on? Hey, how you doing? Welcome back. Well, you welcome back. Welcome me back, right? This time I get to, to, to welcome myself back. It's been a second, hasn't it? I know. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to me uh, streaming. Well, look, if for some of you that, you know, might not have been here for the last uh, week or week and a half or had no idea what's been going on, I've been sick. Very, very sick, and I'm still trying to get over it, so I do apologize in, in, in ahead of advance. Look, if there's some stuff, coughing in stuff today, I apologize on that. But yeah, um, I'm feeling a lot better. I am. It, it knocked me out, man. It knocked me out. But I'm here, and I'm back. And I'm the best way <clears throat> that I could actually bring myself back or ease myself back into the situation was actually cleaning pools. Um, this game comes out. I think very soon. I think tomorrow maybe it might come out. Yeah. Pool cleaning simulator. You ever you ever played like power wash simulator, right? That relaxation, that 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 feeling of just cleaning something, right? That's how I'm gonna ease back into this. Is just kind of clean stuff and maybe just talk nonsense with all of y'all. Yeah. So that's that. What else was I going to say? Oh, yeah. Shout out to the devs for sending me a key to check out this game as well. With me being gone for like, you know, some time. Um, <laughs> I've kind of, let's just say, I've kind of, I'm, I'm backloaded here. I am. I am. I'm a, I got, I got priorities I got to take care of for sure. Um, when it comes to covering games and stuff like that. And this is a good time to cover some pool cleaning simulator. How you doing? Welcome back, everybody. Good to see you. What's going on? Yeah. Welcome in, everybody. Hello, Hope Hero. Hello, Susie T. Hello, Velvet Glove. What's happening, Serendipity? Hello, Ambers. Aaron McKenzie, welcome in. Bedtime. Process Blackthorn. How you doing, Blackthorn? Chibi, how are you? Good to see you. Hello, Barclay. Welcome in. Game Station. Good to see you. Good to say today's stream sponsored by Dayquil. I wish. <laughs> Don't make me laugh or I'll start choking a, choking a freaking lung here. Uh, <clears throat> Welcome in, Serendipity. How are you? Good to see you, T. How's it going? Hello, Shay. How you doing, Shay? How you doing, Lissa? What's happening? Good to see you. How you doing, Maggie? Welcome in. Welcome in. Shari. How you doing, Shari? What's happening? Elaine, how you doing? Never been, never played it, but watch others play it. It's very, it's very, it's even relaxing to watch. I'm very happy to hear that. Very happy to hear that. Hey, Masumi, how, how's it going? Welcome in. Welcome in. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. The uh, Nymphant Possibilities. Love the name. How you doing, Summer Sunshine? Welcome in. Hannah, how are you, Hannah? What's going on, Lady Fluffy Dragon? Good to see you. Welcome in. Maya, how are you, Maya? Welcome, welcome. Everybody lurking, smirking, and possibly working today on this crap. I don't know what today is. Tuesday. The Tuesday? Yeah. Tuesday. I think so. Anyways, let's clean some pools, shall we? Yeah. Simness, how you doing, Simness? How's it going? Welcome. Um, so in case you didn't know, we have played this game on the channel before. We did a first look. We did a let's look at this game months ago. And um, people seem to really like it. It was very short and sweet. And um, I'm a big simulator kind of guy in case you're new to the channel. I like playing simulators as well. So um, it, yeah, it was just kind of natural to, you know, stream this one today. Serendipity with the 13 months. Oh my lord. Says ho hugs to you and Danielle. It's good to see your face. How are you? Thank you, Serendipity. Appreciate that. Thank you for the 13 freaking months. That's incredible. Thank you for 13 months. Whoa. The music just came in hot. Right? Um. Send me back. <laughs> send me back for, for half a second. Okay. Send me back in. <laughs> All right, there we go. Hey, Lynn, how are you, Lynn? Good to see you. Welcome in. Okay, so neighborhood pool part one. Yeah, this is something we've done before. Now, there's the mail, the inventory, and store, I guess. You can buy stuff. Um, buy a pressure washer. Hint. How much money do we have? $500? Okay, yeah, buy a pressure washer. Let's, I guess, do that. Not? Is there a pressure washer here? Oh, this is it. It looks like a screwdriver, dude. Okay. Pressure washer bot. 
Uh, buy a container of chlorine tabs. Got you. Remember to equip items in the inventory and open your inventory. Oh, okay. Okay, this game's got some, like, a lot of sound effects and a lot of music rolling. We got machines. What about a sponge? Do I put that in machines? I guess I do. So you're going to go go back to the errands. Wait, go back to errands and accept the mission. Okay, <laughs> errands. Interesting choice of words there. Like the uh, yeah email. I need a sponge pressure washer. Okay, all right. So it's basically telling me how to do things very well. Tommy Quaker. All right, Tommy Quaker. How are you, Tommy Qu Quaker? I would like to. In Why did you email me all in capital letters, Tommy? I would like to inquire about your company's services. Spring is just around the corner, and my pool is still uncleaned from water. Still unclean. I need a complete algae remove and uh, water disinfectant with chlorine. Chlorine tablets float in water control system are in my shed next to the pool oh and if you have some free time i'd like you to do one more little thing see if see i oh this is the rubber duck guy see i'm a big rubber duck fan unfortunately my kids have lost some of my best rubber ducks from my collection if you see any in the yard oh yeah 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 i remember now okay it's like an easter egg hunt but with like you know <laughs> rubber ducks <laughs> Oh my goodness gracious. This is awesome. Oh, very good. Hey, thank you for the five months. Thank you, Lady Fluffy Dragon. I appreciate that. Thank you. Welcome back, Hans and Danielle and the Fur Babies. I appreciate that, Lady Fluffy Dragon. That was very, very, very kind of you. Indeed. Wait, is this the same thing here? Yeah. <clears throat> How's it going, Kyle? How's it going, Debbie? Good to see you. Welcome in. Welcome in. Yes, yes, yes. Avalon, how are you? Good to see you as well. This was easy. Look, we've done this. We know. Oh, God. We know how to do this. Now, this guy has rubber ducks scattered about. And all we have to do is find them as an optional thing, right? Find them. And then clean his pool. That's pretty much all we're doing today. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Yeah, absolutely. Anonymous tipped $50. Hails to the man who defeated the virus and destroyed the Death Star. May the force be with you. Thank you. <laughs> My goodness gracious. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the anonymous on the $50 tip. Holy crap. That was very kind. Very kind indeed. Um, I... I think the Death Star defeated me, but I appreciate that. Thank you very much. That was very kind to you indeed. Thank, thank you. So there's ducks happening. <laughs> That was so funny. <laughs> drain the pool. Okay, so we have to drain the pool. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait, wait, wait. Open the tab and click... Oh, wait, click tab to open a message from the customer. Very well. And okay, we have done... Did that? Empty the pool. Clean the pool. Fill the pool. Fill the floater. Put the floater into the pool. Bring your tools back to the van. Da, da, da. Optional, do the ducks. We will definitely do the optional quests here. Hey, Highlander. How's it going? Good to see you. Welcome in. Yes, yes, yes. <clears throat> time a lime time a lime how are you good to see you as well good to see you welcome in welcome in carbonated crouton how are you good to see you thank you thank you how are you all right let's do it let's start emptying emptying the pool okay let's do it okay use e to interact very well okay we've done did it oh are we draining dude we're draining all right we're drained. <clears throat> Very satisfied. Oh, how nice. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> All right, give me a duck. Yes, okay, so this man has an obsession of rubber ducks. We have to collect all of his rubber ducks. They're all hiding. It's like a little Easter egg hunt, which I really do enjoy. Um, you know, you, I don't think... You, you can't be too old for an Easter egg hunt. I think Easter egg hunts are not just for children. Let's just be real here. You put a $100 bill, $50 bill, and a little tiny plastic egg, I'm searching for it. You know what I mean? Yeah, absolutely. How you doing, Emma? What's going on? FBK, how are you? Uh, turn that off for copyright reasons because 
I don't know. I, I don't want to get slammed hard today. I'd rather not. Perfect. Weak my duck right there. Can I touch this? Oh, yeah. We, we, I, I'm starting to, it's starting to come back to me memory wise. When we did a video of this uh, game, we actually did this mission before, which is why I'm like the best Easter egg hunter of all time. But, uh, like I made up a story about this house and I made up a story about who lives here and about the housewife and everything and all that. And it was just fantastic. How many uh, ducks is that? Seven out of 15 now? Yeah. Okay. Seven out of 15. We'll get to the look the pools last <laughs> i'm not worried about your pool sir i'm worried about your ducks first priority my dogs would freak out if they heard this squeak action right now <clears throat> there we go okay you see you, you gotta you gotta kind of like i know where some of them are i don't know where all of them are okay that's a good spot for a duck i remember there being like a gray one somewhere like I don't know right here no i thought there was like a gray one. Oh, it's like right here right yeah 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 love it love it there we go easter egg hunts are like looking for treasure just scratches that one brain itch it does it does don't it i don't know how far we go with these ducks i guess all the way over here that's a mallard there we go there you go perfect where are we at 12 out of 15 now i don't think there was one inside right oh there's one right here Oh crap, dude. There's gonna be two ducks left and I don't know what I'm gonna do. This is now duck hunting. Um dunk duck hunting uh what is it? Duck hunting simulator? Yeah. I don't think there's anything over here. Yeah, I'm not sure. I don't think so. I don't remember there being something so far out. Yeah. Hey Fiona, how are you? Hey Samantha, what's going on? There's one in the shed? Is there one in the shed? I didn't think there was. There's one in the shed? Oh, there is, there's one in the bucket. Is that like a purple one? Okay, this is like the second to last one, yeah? All right, I don't know where the last one is. Weak. Okay, I found the last one. It's like a Pokemon, dude. All right. Ducks are done. We have completed the duck. Now we get to actually clean the pool. I know, the boring part. Ay, ay, ay. All right, so let's see here. We got to figure out how to... Oh, get our cleaning supplies out of the van. Let's do that first. Oh, baby. Give me my power washer. To start cleaning, you need to get the sponge out of the van. No, I disagree. I need to get the freaking power washer, dude. Can we go like this? Okay, if you equipped any pressure washer upgrades, you can gain, you can access them. Okay, so <clears throat> I'll scrub first. Make the game, like, happy. Okay, it should be happy. And now the next thing I shall do. Give me the power washer. Okay, I'm going to hit him with this, dude. I'm going to hit him with this. This should be good to go, yeah? Oh, there we are. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Now, wait. I think I could have the sponge and the power washer maybe both at the same time. I don't know which which is faster. But I'm assuming this is. Now, I think maybe possibly you get, like, skills and something like that. So, we're just going to clean here. No big deal. Yeah. Those ducks are huge. I know. Now... I would love a pool, but like, honestly, I don't know. I don't know what's better, having a pool yourself or knowing a friend that owns a pool. Why do I say that? Well, I say pools are expensive first and foremost. Um, the bill on them was just like, could you imagine the electric bill, the water bill? Keeping them clean, right? It's like, I think me personally, I would have a pool and I'd be like, man, this is cool, but then when I'm relaxing in the pool, I'm like, man, imagine how much money this is costing me right now. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Maybe that's just me. I could be weird like that. Man, this is this this feels nice. This feels real good. Pretty tiresome, right? Go grab a power washer for more efficiency. Yeah, way ahead of you. That was loud. Way ahead of you, partner. <clears throat> definitely the friend no maintenance exactly definitely the friend no maintenance i'll let the friend deal with the maintenance and the bill i'll just come over and uh i'll 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 provide comedy that's 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 the best that i can do for you yeah hey friend neck how are you good to see you hey lauren how are you lauren welcome in welcome in indeed <laughs> i don't know i don't think i could be like chilling there at the pool like i don't know dude <laughs> 
I don't even... I don't know, man. I don't know. I could be wrong, though. It all depends. Maybe a, having a pool is really, really cool, you know? Maybe it's, like, one of the best things ever. Now, okay, hot tub? That's a little bit different. If you have a hot tub, I could let that slide. Yes, there's maintenance to it. Yes, there's, you know, electricity power built to it. But, like, it's not as intense. You know what I mean? I don't know. It's not as intense as having a giant pool. I don't know. Yeah. I think it all depends on where you live, too. Right? I think it all depends on where you live. How much are you using the pool? Or how much can the pool be used throughout the year? Now, here where I live, you could probably use the pool eight months out of the year. Like, maybe three months you won't, you know... You won't, like, use it. But, like, for the most part, you're using it every single day. Florida, I believe you use it even more. You know what I mean? Yeah. Florida, you use more. How's it going, Digger Paint? How are you? Good to see you. My city ordinance is if you have a pool up to two feet without getting permits. Wait, you can have a pool up to two feet without having any permits? Sounds like a... Sounds like a puddle. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, my lord. Oh, very good. I don't know what that, that loud ding is. It's like a loud ding. I'm like walking into Seize Candy looking for the register. Actually, you know, I take that back. Anytime you go into Seize Candy, the cashiers are always there. They're not ever not there. They're there messing around with the chocolate. And then you walk up to them and they're like, hey, would you like a sample? And I say yes. And then I don't know what a cherry cordial is. And then I put it in my mouth and I'm like, this is disgusting. And then I walk out with a sour. And no offense. Like, honestly, no offense to like. To the to the to the C's candy lady. But like, this is not what I was expecting. There we go. Okay, perfect. I think we're doing good. Yeah, we got the rim. We're doing the. Oh, my Lord. We done did the rib. The rim job. There we go. Perfect. Don't that, you know. Stop it. Don't think about that yet. Okay. Did we empty? Okay, we empty the pool, clean the pool, fill the pool, fill the floater. Are we doing good? Oh wait, is there a um is there a vision that you can see? Sometimes in these games Did I just knock over the chair? I'm so sorry. Sometimes in these games you can actually see a vision on what you need to do next. Oh god, I dropped my thing. Oi. Okay. Maybe we're good? I don't know. Are we good? I hope so, dude. I don't know. I want to see if I can actually grab uh, multiple items here. Let's see if I can grab multiple items. Okay, this will slide right there. And this will slide over here as well. There we go. Okay. So, give me chlorine. Okay. Give me that. Give me that. Okay. <laughs> no. <laughs> you cannot carry multiple things at once. All right. Very well. <sighs> okay, I think we're good. I don't think we need to scrub anything anymore, right? Maybe? I don't know. It's so hard to tell. I'm scrubbing dubbing, dude. Okay, you know what? Probably best course of action here. Power wash. Yeah, power washer. 13 months, Susie T. Thank you for the 13 months. One year, one month, three days, seven hours, 24 minutes, and, every, and worth every second. Did you just count down from... What did you just do there, Susie? It, how did you have that number of countdown? Did you just pull that out of a rat... Like, is that like a rabbit hat kind of joke? What the heck was that? That's incredible. The pool's not clean enough? Oh, no. Okay, we gotta like... Okay, I think the pool's clean enough. <laughs> did we do it? I think we did it. Okay. Good job, cans. I don't know. All right, so now we filled the pool, right? And I think I think we're ready to go, right? It's still not done. You will hear the ding sound once it's cleaned. I've heard the ding sound like twenty times already, though. Still not clean. Okay. What? Do you want from me? 
The circle next to the clean the pool will churn orange when it's done. I would agree with that, except that you would think that the circle next to the empty the pool would also churn orange. <laughs> I think it is clean because of the bar. Do we test it? Do we add water to it? Empty the pool is is orange. I thought like fill it in, but you're right. Maybe they should need to fill it in and not make it like an outline. Okay. I don't know what the frick needs to be clean. Oh my goodness. What about the bar though? The 33% bar. What about that bar? It has turned orange. Well, okay. Filled in orange. Kind of like a... Uh, what is it? The, what are those things called that people like? Jaffa cakes? Look. I know I'm going to hurt a lot of feelings here. I've had Jaffa cakes. I don't understand the hype. Okay, well, I did it. <laughs> Fill it up. <laughs> I don't know, dude. Uh, now you will need to purify the water. Some cleaning tools need chemical products to work right. Try using chlorine tabs from Van on floater in the shed to fill it before putting in the water. Wait, what? Before putting in the water? Oh, before putting it in the water. Okay, got it. We got it. This is the biggest floater of all time. Holy hell. Uh, give me my chlorine tabs, please. How many do I need to put in? One. I'm really not sure how many. Two. Two. Three, four, <laughs> just fill it in. What is a Jaffa cake? It's a, uh, some would say a biscuit, but they're named cake because there's some tax thing in Europe where like if something is a cake, then like a biscuit, then you get like a... I don't know some tax thing going on so they name it Jaffa cake when is it really a cake it's more of a biscuit type thing but there's like orange chocolate fluffy orange jelly jam in it I guess if you're in Europe you call it jam we call it jelly over here but yeah it's in a nutshell <laughs> it's not good I don't know no no disrespect to the Jaffa cake lovers as they wait for my pool to fill Okay, we filled the floater. Now we put the floater in the pool. We have put the floater in the pool. Now bring your tools back to the van. I think we we done did it now, haven't we? I think we... Oh, there's my sponge. <clears throat> you keep saying Europe when I mean the UK? That's true. Yeah. I don't want to single out the UK though. Because it sounds rude. Even though they are doing the one, they're all, they're, you know, for the most part, let's, let's be honest. They're the, out of everybody in Europe, they're, they're the ones making things a little bit hard for us to understand over here in the West. Uh, if you're done with everything and you have all your stuff back, check out your mail using the tab. Very well. We've completed this job. Um, developers, if you are watching this, I would highly suggest filling in these circles than just giving them an outline. A little confusing. Complete. Hey, man. Thank... What if I'm a woman? <laughs> hey, man. Thank you so much for finding those dot. Du sorry, ducks. Those are collectibles. Who knows where those gummy birds would end up if not for you? I send you a letter, a little extra for your effort. Thanks again, man. Tommy? Excuse me. What did you just say? Gummy birds? You gave me 10 extra dollars for picking up your freaking ducks. Your wife must be proud. All right. Next, next job, please. Yeah. Next job. Sounds like a complicated cake. Exactly. <clears throat> okay. We have a hotel pool. A murder. Did somebody say a murder swimming pool? Pool swimming pool and an aqua park. Oh my God. I don't know where I should go next. Hotel. Pressure washer. Land. I don't even know what the hell this is. Landing net. Oh, I guess that's what it is. Filter. Okay. We gotta buy stuff. 
the music is dropping on top of us right now. What the heck is this? This is a landing net. Okay, landing net. What is this? Underwater vacuum cleaner? Thick. <coughs> Filter. Uh, what is this? Wide tip. Wide nozzle for pressure washer, versatile and efficient in removing dirt from various services. I shall buy. Okay. Should I go to the hotel or should I go to the aqua park? I'll go to the aqua park. Actually, I will not go to the aqua park because it's asking for a vacuum cleaner. All right. So I guess this game wants you to go in order here, huh? Okay. Very well. Uh, inventory, please. Uh, filters. Landing net. Pressure washer. Like F the sponge politely. Wide tip. Yes. Are we good? Yeah, we're ready to go. Send me to the hotel. Manager of Hotel Paradise. That's not how you spell paradise, is it? <laughs> oh, God damn. It's not. <laughs> Please tell me that's not how you spell paradise. Oh, God. Maybe that's just how they spell it. Regards on half of Hotel Paradise, I am looking for a professional pool cleaning service that could solve our piranha problem. One of our customers accidentally let these angry fish into our pool and we had to evacuate the entire area. If you can make them disappear and clean our pool, that would be great. Remember to replace the filter. The code for our pipe box is 5532. This pipe system is quite complicated, so here are some instructions. To empty the pool, you have to press the red, big red button and move the red lever. To refill it, turn the red wheel valve three times. This is too many instructions. The wheel valve three times, move the blue lever and press the blue button. If the filter has been replaced correctly, clean water should flow. What did you just say, Adam Salomon? Optional, find the hidden treasure. Oh my God. I had to do a, like a, I had to do a bop it just to unlock the code here. Okay. Oh my Lord. Okay. <laughs> okay. So take care of the piranhas first. What hotel guests thought it was funny to put piranhas in the pool? First of all, F that guy. Give me my landing net. Come here. I'm terrified. Okay. What do I do with this? <laughs> do I just dump it? Uh-oh. No? I know they're a terrifying fish, but we had to do something with them. That's responsible. Uh, where's the grill at? Do I put them in here? I don't know where to put the piranhas. They didn't say where to put them. In here? Okay. 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 I, I don't know what I just did. Fair enough. Come here. Okay. All right. Okay. Oh, this is so hard. <laughs> there we go. I'm, I'm sorry. How do you accidentally release piranhas in a swimming pool? I know. I think it w Oh, God. Oh, God. All the piranhas are there. I don't think it's accidental. This is totally sabotage. This is a weird looking pool, too, if I, I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know what I'm doing with them. I'm just... I'm sticking them. Okay. What have I done? Do I put them in the box? I... Oh god. <laughs> Kira, thank you for the 10 months, Kira. Appreciate it. Thank you, Kira. Oh, this is the code thing that we have to oh god do. Okay. Thank you for the 10 months. I appreciate that. Accidentally on purpose. Um maybe I put him in the box. Grab him. I put him in the box. There you go. Okay, yeah, you put him in the box. Be more clear about it. All I'm saying. There you go. I don't know why we would put them in the box. I would hope that the box would be like, I don't have water in it. That's good. There we are. Okay. You freaking game, I tell you. Okay, there we go. All right. We've done did it. Good job. Good job, cans. Okay, now empty the pool. I don't. 
that's a big ass landing net wow that's huge okay so it has to do something with uh with this code i think too right thank you zaris for the super chat i appreciate that thank you very much assassination attempt <laughs> <laughs> oh man okay so let me read this again what the heck are you asking if you can make them disappear okay Remember to replace the filter. The code for our pipe box is 5532. Okay. I would like to use this. 5532. That's the combination to my pipe box also. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, right. Email, please. The pipe system is quite complicated, so here are some instructions. To empty the pool, you have to press the red button and move the red lever. Okay, red button, red lever. Did I do it? Is it empty? Wait, this red lever. That's a that's a turny tossy thingy. Did I do it? Red lever. I did it. I don't know how to get out of this screen, though. Good job. Okay. Back me out. Thank you. Oh. Ugh. How do you get your pool this dirty, sir? This is ridiculous. It kind of reminds me of, like, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory with Johnny Depp. And, like, they walked in. Or, like, it was like that... It's that scene where, like, I don't know, the chocolate prince. And, like, the he, like, wanted to have, like, a chocolate temple. And, like, the chocolate temple started melting. I don't know why. That just reminded me. It just reminded me of it. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Give me a wider tip, though. Thank you. <laughs> hey, Riley. Thank you for the six months, Riley. I appreciate that. Thank you very much, Riley. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. How are you? Good to see you. Half a year. Oh, baby. Bree Love says, this is the first live. I enjoy watching your videos. I appreciate that, Bree Love. How are you? Good to see you. <laughs> Makes me have to tinkle hearing that sound of the water go down. <laughs> there was another game that did that too. I think it was Everdream Valley. Every time we uh, filled our watering can... I think a lot of people were like, yeah, I got to go to the bathroom now. <clears throat> you get a pool that dirty by putting piranhas in it, I guess. Yeah, this is a bunch of like piranha dumpings, I guess. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <clears throat> it's the pool from Karate Kid 1. Oh, my God. <laughs> Why did he leave it so dirty? I'll do the outside. I work my outside, you know, play with the outside and then I'll go in. That's what I'll do. That pool looks almost as nasty as the one at my old place where I was sharing a home with four other people in Florida. The landlord wouldn't keep up the pool and it was so green and it had algae. Oh God, that's terrible. That's another thing is like, you're in a situation where like, you have like a communal pool, I guess. If you like live in a neighborhood where like a bunch of other people also use uh the pool like we have that where i live like there's a pool like probably 30 feet outside of my door okay that's a little okay maybe 300 feet outside my door there's a pool outside and i i could go to it anytime i want but like everybody else goes to it so i don't know for me i don't know am i weird about this but anytime i I, I do like I go to a pool. I was never a big person when it came to like Thank you for the ding uh, for like public pools. I feel like anytime I use a pool uh, It's like a private moment It's like I rather have privacy In a pool does that make any sense? I don't know am I weird? I might be very weird But like I'm never like a big fan of public pools I'm never a big fan of like water parks or anything like that. I don't know. 
there's something about taking off my clothes and getting in water that I feel like it's a private moment. You know what I mean? Again, that could be me. I don't know. I feel like I need to share that with family and loved ones, not with the guy I just met at Circle K. So no beach. You know, I used to swim at the beach quite often when I was younger. This was back when I had like no phobia of like the ocean sweeping me out and taking me for a ride and or sharks. And I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear you, you know, the likelihood of getting hit by a shark or bit by a shark is like slim to none. I know, but they live there and they swim there and my feet are there and other objects that dangle are also in there too so in a nutshell i don't trust it i don't trust it andrea welcome back glad you're feeling better thank you andrea <laughs> appreciate that that was very kind of you sweet sweet thank yous appreciate that Thank you for the 50 super chat 50 anonymous tip today and the 50 super chat with some other super chats and other re-ups on memberships i appreciate the support y'all thank you thank you very much i appreciate that thank you thank you that was very very kind of you andrea andrea and very kind of anonymous as well earlier thank you y'all appreciate you i prefer a private pool but i have enjoyed using our local pool, public pool Try to choose, choose a time where there's fewer people. <clears throat> no public pools for you either? Yeah, see, like... I got no problem with, like, getting a bunch of friends and let's go swimming. But, like... I don't want, like... I don't want, like... Look, I don't want to be swimming in a pool. And, like, I accidentally am swimming. Right? And little Joey decides to swim past me and i accidentally kick little joey right and karen comes out and whoops my ass in front of everybody you know um that's what i don't want change the filter time all right change the filter let's do it how do we do that okay so here are some instructions to empty the pool you have to press the red red lever to refill it no 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 turn the red wheel no 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 move the blue lever Press the blue button. If the filter has been replaced correctly, clean water should flow. Okay, so we need to do... Okay, give me the filter first. Give me this, yeah. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Here we go. What are you doing in a pool that you need your privacy? Enjoying life, baby. That's what it is. Do I have to put this code in again? Is it 2-3 or 3-2? F. Okay, filter. Perfect okay good, good job okay okay now we need to fill the water right so how do we do that again okay to empty the pool okay okay to refill it turn the red lever or sorry the wheel three times move the blue lever and press the blue button oh god okay okay so one two three lever button I'm the greatest of all time. Yeah, I know. Thank you. And this will go into your piranhas as well. <laughs> all right. Fill the pool. Bring your tools back to the... Oh, wait. We have to find treasure. That was like optional, right? Wait. How do we find treasure here? What the hell? I just realized that we have to find treasure. Did that just open a secret door? Wait a sec. Are we fighting it? 
Oh my god. <laughs> There's so many buttons. Did I do it? This is crazy, yo. This is crazy. Even though, you know what? I do wish I was not such a weirdo when it came to pools because swimming is good exercise for you. It is. It's really good exercise for you. Did I miss a button? Or did something open? Oh my gosh. Did I... Did I do it? Did I push it all? I can't even tell, dude. I don't even know. On Handy Pillow, how are you? Good to see you. Welcome in. There's several of those buttons. Did I push them all? Am I missing one? Hey, Cozy Joe. How's it going? Welcome in. Time for another duck hunt. I know, right? Except for these are loose bricks. <laughs> I, I it, look if you're telling me I have to push him in a certain order you can kiss me goodbye but I don't think that's the uh, that's the case here I just gotta like look look must be missing one definitely have done that one. Oh, right there right there right there right there oh, there it is I did it i don't get to keep it i don't get to have it i don't get to play with it i get to look at it that's no fun i want to touch it damn it well we found the treasure all right bring your tools back uh oh get to bring the filter back <laughs> all right we did it 100 hooray all right mr freaking paradise the pool cleaner has found a hidden treasure. No one has been able to solve this mystery for many years. You telling me it's taken y'all many years to figure out how to do this puzzle and I just did it in five minutes. The owner of the hotel promises more puzzles of this type. Congratulations to the winner. $500 and $50 for finding the additional thing thing doohickey. Very well. All right. GG. <laughs> <laughs> All right, murder swimming pool. What the frick is this? Why can't I tag people while watching on the phone? Uh, that's just how YouTube is. The only way to tag people is if you are on uh, PC. Yeah. What do I need for this? A UV lamp, a filter, pressure washer. Okay. UV lamp. Another filter. Okay. Inventory. Um. Uh, wide tip, pressure washer, UV lamp, and I think that's good. No upgrades? Okay. I don't know what this is. Murder deep, murder swimming pool? This sounds, what the hell is going, Sharkinator? Sebastian Shark, Sharkinator? Hey, I need your help, bro. There was an accident in my swimming pool. The whole area is covered in blood and garbage. In addition, the police have launched an investigation and are looking for evidence among all the things in the pool. He seemed like a legitimate homie who doesn't cooperate with the police. I leave the decision of what to do with it to you. The code for the canteen is 3960. The manual is inside. Greetings. Sebastian, Sh why did you just say greetings? Oh my God. What the hell is that? Task step? Empty the pool, clean the pool, change the filter, task step, task step. What are you asking me? There's an accidental warning. Be warned that this level contains drastic elements. You want to enable censorship? <laughs> what was I expecting with this game? All right, well, <clears throat> let this be known to y'all. This is my warning to you. We will not do censorship. Empty the pool, clean the pool, change the filter, fill the pool, clean stains around the pool. Bring your tools back to the van, collect 26 trash and optional mark evidence. Am I even qualified to mark evidence? I'm a pool cleaner, dude. 
Ah, very well. One through six. Right. Oh, shit. Okay, give me the washer. It's so dark. Okay, this is more than an accident. I see a rubber duck, though, so I guess I know who might be the perpetrator here. Yep. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, the first thing we want to do is empty the pool. Oh, my God. Are they in the closet? <laughs> oh, no. What was the code? <laughs> oh, no. Uh, three, nine, wait, three, nine, six, zero. Three, nine, six, zero. Oh my God. What the heck? I had to follow this thing to know what, I can't even see, it's dark. Give me a light. Um. Okay. This must be, okay, this is drain. So give me blue button. I hit blue button. Give me that, to that, to th that, to that. Did I do it? I did not. Look, this is Kool-Aid, okay? This is not a murder scene. This is Kool-Aid. Remember to use your UV light. Okay, good question. Good question? No. Good call. Oh my god. Sounds like I just turned on my refrigerator. Wait. What is happening here? Oh, oh god, it's massive, dude. It is like a, a... What the heck? Why is this so big? Okay. This, okay, I see water down. That's what that means, right? Water's down. Look here. I, I feel like I've done, okay, get the, get this TV out of here. You look that way. That says water down, right? So if I want to go water down, it says just blue lever. Okay. So blue button hit you with this, hit you with this, hit you with this. Okay, we have done did it. The Kool-Aid is leaving the building. There we go. <laughs> The Kool-Aid has left the building, baby. Oh, goodness gracious. All right. I don't know what the heck I'm using this giant light for, though. Okay, so that's taken care of. There's the duck. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, turn that off. That's driving me nuts. What is this? This must be like evidence. Is there anything else I need to know about? What is this? Santana? What is this? Okay, give me this. This is like hotel hell. I walk into my hotel room with my UV light and then I check out immediately because I never thought that I would see what I would see. And then I actually saw what I saw and I'm like, you know what? I am going to judge this hotel based off of my UV light. But I have to also think to myself, every hotel is like this. You can't tell me there's not a hotel that's not like this. What the hell am I talking about? It doesn't matter. How did they not get the body out of here yet? I Who's doing the policing here? What's happening? Hey, it looks like possibly a woman was involved. 24658. Significant? I don't know. Photo of the news. No, thank you. What in the world is happening? That supersized me? Okay. I am so confused with what's happening here. I'm going to leave you staring at the wall for now. Are we almost done, Kool-Aid? Oh, it has a diving board. That's nice. 
this is not like somebody slipped and fell. This is not somebody that died. This is a massacre. Okay, clean the pool now. Very well. Put my tip on. Hey, subscriber. And also, thank you for subscribing, Geeky M Mina Mina. Let me wash up now. now. I don't know if I need to do the outside or if I just need to do the inside. I guess maybe the outside would uh, also be kind of generous of me to do, huh? <clears throat> right. <laughs> never take a UV light into a hotel bedroom. You will never sleep in a hotel ever again. Did I ever tell the story that Danielle and I... We were in LA one time and we went to a hotel and it was in a rough part of LA. I was scared, dude. But I had to sleep because where else was I going to sleep, I guess. But like it was so bad it was absolutely so bad like it was one of those places where you walked in like okay it was like we're talking like midnight we're talking like one in the morning like where are you gonna go at one in the morning when you're in la you can't just like go so, so what we had is what we had right and it was to the point where like you knew Stuff had gone down in there and then like you pull back the shower curtains and you like you see cockroaches and you see spiders and you see mess that was left over by the previous tenants and you see there's stains on the bed and it's the kind of hotel where it's like you don't if you go outside and complain to the front desk you're probably gonna get a nice ass whooping Plus, there was people hanging out outside that were kind of shady. So, basically, in that situation, you just kind of say, you know what? We'll deal with it. <laughs> I kid you not. It was so bad. It was so bad. And Danielle can vouch for this because she was there and she did the same exact thing. It was so bad that we went to our suitcases. We went to our luggage. And we decided to pull out ponchos. And we slept fully clothed with ponchos on. And the ponchos had hoods on. And that's how we slept for like five hours. And then as soon as it like broke dawn, like it's time to get to the, you know, as the sun's coming out, we got the hell out of Dodge. We went to a new hotel. <laughs> But oh my gosh, we like slept in ponchos and it was so hot. Oh man. It's like, you know how those people wear those sweatsuits, those plastic sweatsuits. It's like something like that, right? And you just fall asleep. Like no big deal. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. Let's just say the hotel was not advertised correctly. I was very upset. Did I leave a review? I did not. Why? Because I've been banned. And I know a lot of you that have followed my channel for a while know that I was in LA again. And I was banned from a Motel 6 because I left the review. <clears throat> so don't leave reviews it's probably why i don't do like proper reviews of games on my channel because people will probably like ban me or something <laughs> and it was sad because it was like a motel six i used to actually frequent a lot a lot and i put a lot of money into that place and all i simply said was like hey you know i really like this place however I wish that when I drove my car through your parking lot, there wouldn't be potholes. I wish the roads were better. Also, I wish there was more security because there was some shady stuff going on outside in the middle of the night. That's all I said. I gave it a three out of five stars. They banned me and they didn't tell me why they banned me, but I know that's why they banned me. They had no other reason. I show up one time and they're like, oh, sorry, sir. You're banned from our hotel. And I said, what the hell are you talking about? How can you ban me from the hotel? I made a reservation. That doesn't make any sense. They said, well, in our records, it shows that you're banned. Danielle's not banned. 
But I am. Because I made the review. Even though every time I've gone to that hotel, I was with Danielle. So. Yeah. I stopped uh, writing reviews <clears throat> ever since that incident. And I'm not going to be making no reviews on no games. Because... People don't like what I have to say. <laughs> Let's be honest. People don't like the truth. And it sucks. That's alright. Whatever. I'm just here playing video games. That's what matters, right? <laughs> you can review positive stuff. Well, I mean, if I review positive stuff, then I have to search for positive stuff. And then, like, what if there's negatives and positives? I can't leave out negatives. Right? That wouldn't be very transparent. I mean, I would that. That'd be like, you only say positive things about stuff. You can't be positive all the time. Well, we don't live in a perfect world. I agree. There are some pros and cons to everything we do and everything we play and everything we have in life. Right? Not all fine and dandy. And I'm not going to be the one blowing smoke up your rear end and tell you that it is. <clears throat> Again, now that I've kind of ex exited my mind with like Kool-Aid, this is like a Kool-Aid like, whoops, I spilled the bottle of ketchup situation now. Whoops, I forgot that I brought Heinz ketchup to the swimming pool as I was trying to eat my, my hot dog. And that was like one thing, like I like I before I made that review about the hotel, I never ever never wrote any reviews about anything, but because I was so passionate and I was so so happy about this one hotel that I used to be at, I used to go to all the time because of location one and just how actually clean and neat it was. I was like, "Yo, I care about this place. I put a lot of money into this place. I want to see it succeed." Here's some things that you could work on. Like, I thought I was doing a good thing. Turns out, I was doing a bad thing. I spoke with the manager, too. I said, this is BS. You know what they told me? They told me that I got banned because of a noise complaint. Which is also BS. Because they're like, we sent security to your room three times. And I said, that's also BS. It was me and Danielle. What do you mean you s there was a noise complaint? I got banned from a noise complaint? I even asked them directly and they couldn't even provide uh, information about it. I said, if security was sent to my room three times, then security should have a log of that. Security should have it written down that they went to my room three times. They couldn't provide that. So they were bluffing, dude. They were BSing me up and down. And you know what? I felt disrespected anyways. And I was like, you know what? Whatever. Ban or not, I don't care. I'm not coming back here anymore. Because I asked them specifically. I said, how long am I banned? They said, for life. I said, all right. And y'all has asked me. She's like, we should go to that place and try to go to that place again. I said, no, I don't want to go to that place. I know you're not banned, but like, I don't want to go because like, that was disrespectful, man. Is this game created by the same people that made Power Wash Simulator? No, this is not. Like, every time I drove in their parking lot, I had to dodge, like, 20 potholes. That was, like... I was like, yo, I don't want to, like, break my car just to pull into a parking spot. Okay, what am I missing here? I did the outside. Maybe the drains? Oh, baby. Oh, this is going to be a tough one. Hopefully, it's not, like, outside the pool. I think it's not. I think it's all on the inside. I think I just got to thoroughly go through it. Oh, UV light? That's a good idea. A wonderful idea. It's uh, the green stuff, I guess. Is that what it is? Green? Yeah. 
All right, let's do that. Ah. 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 Ah, very good, very good, very good. Okay, good, 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 good. Maybe that's why the UV light is so massive. Very good. So you really, really got to dig deep, maybe? What do you think? Oh, gosh. I can't tell. I can't tell if I'm making a difference or not. Maybe not. Maybe some difference? That looks bad, no? Yeah, I guess I'm doing it. Yeah. I guess I'm doing it. I don't know about the flooring. The wall, yeah, maybe. <clears throat> hey, Mel. How you doing, Mel? <laughs> That's very true. Yeah, after a long drive, I had to figure out where to freaking uh stay that night and had to pay a premium price because it was same night delivery <laughs> or same night uh ooh. uh same night uh finding a spot and it wasn't it wasn't for one night either it was like a week long also do the drains real quick there we go okay Turn this bad boy around there we are look at that perfect okay don't move Okay, all right. Yeah, yeah. A little tedious, I'll, I'll admit, but that's all right. We got it going. We got it going. We got it going. As long as our meter is going up. Oh my god, we did it. Greatest of all time. Okay, good job, everybody. Wonderful. I don't know how I'm going to do this optional mark evidence thing. Whew, I'm sweating, man. By the way, thank you, Katie, for uh, subscribing as well. So, okay, empty the pool. Wait a sec. It, wait. Did did I not clean the pool? I thought that ding was clean the pool. It doesn't give me an orange uh an orange uh orange circle. <laughs> uh oh. No, it looks clean. Yep, it looks clean. Okay. Right. Whoops, I guess. Anyways. Filter time. How do I change the filter? Okay, change the filter here, right? The two filters. That filter? Oh my god. Nope. Okay, no. Maybe grab a filter? Let's do that. Grab the filter. Then change the filter. There we go. Okay, good. Maybe I got to do the other one. Maybe not. Okay. Add that back in there. Okay. Okay. Change filter. Clean pool. Fill the pool. I really hope that it, it does. I think it's, I, I think it's okay. The pool wall was clean. Oh, was it just the pool wall? Okay. So it needs the stairs then. Let's see. Stairs are good. The entire pool, right? Like, nothing's glowing on it. I don't know what's going on. It might be a bug. What do you think? Unless they want us to do the outside. Too. Unless they want us to do, like, out here. But this isn't... I wouldn't consider this the pool. It gave me a ding. That's what matters. All right, so I guess the outside too. Mm -hmm. You haven't had a clean pool ping, so I think you need to do more clean. No, 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 I did have a clean pool ping. It went ping-a-ding-ding. -ding. There we go. Oh, God. Okay. Here we are. Ding. Okay. Mm -mm 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 
Can I get a dang IRL when I finish a task? Oh, I know. <laughs> Can I get a ding IRL when I finish a task? I think if that was the case, we would definitely be uh, doing tasks a little bit more often. Oh, gosh. Like, oh, wash the dishes. Ding. Oh, take out the trash. Ding. Get swatted by the cat. Ding. You don't think that's a chore, then you're absolutely wrong. That is a chore. That's like a daily chore you have to expect. You have a cat? Get swatted. Ding. Ah, yes. I, you know, cleaning this stuff up, I would expect this is like evidence. Maybe? I don't know, dude. The biggest UV light I've ever seen in my life, though. Still can't get over that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Anywhere else? Anywhere else? Anywhere else? My spiciness? Yes. That's a big ID. Identification card, you think? Who needs an ID that big? I guess this was a woman that was possibly murdered. This is actually kind of sad. Ooh. That was a loud ding. How did this game take a, tar a dark turn? That's what I want to know. How did we get to this point? Clean stains around the pool. Okay, so that's done. I think the, the pool the orange circle thing might be bugged. So I'm going to go ahead and fill the pool. Yeah, I'm going to fill the pool. So let's see here. What do I have to do? I have to turn the lever two times. Okay. One. Two. Two. Now, this circles two things. So, I will hit two things. Green. Did I do it? Okay. I did not do it. It circles two things, but maybe that's not correct. Alright, here we go. Hit me again. Okay. I'll do the single one and then I hit you with the green. How are we? You think the diving board? I think I already got dinged on the di diving board though. Yeah, I already got a ding on the diving board. Um. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't even know how to fill the water in there. <clears throat> the pool needs to be 100%. But isn't the pool already 100%? Like, if you walk in the pool, the bar... Okay, not the number, not the number. Because 100% means, I think, the entire task. But the bar is filled, right? Right? Because before we could UV this, but now we can't UV it. Yeah. I think the pool is done. The pool is done, but I think it's just bugged out. That's all I could really say about that. Yeah. <laughs> Try spraying the marked off crime scene. That's a big camera, too. The diving board? How many times did I spray that thing? 
I went up and down around. I touched it. I groped it. I freaking sprayed it. Nothing. I come back and I tap it one time and it's good. <clears throat> I did not want the diving board to cop an attitude. I'm copping an attitude on the diving board's behalf. You saw how many times I tongued that thing, dude. Ay, ay, ay. Let me put water inside of it now. How the hell do I do this part? Okay. Two times around. It says it's misleading. One, two, buckle my shoe. Okay, nothing. Try again. That's fine. Try again. <laughs> oh my god this freaking thing dude okay one three go <laughs> okay okay yeah let's read the email um uh The manual is inside the code for the canteen. I don't know why they call it a canteen. Okay. So that is it. That's that. I'm missing something here. I'm not doing something correct. And I'm really not sure what I'm not doing correct. I'm not sure what I'm doing incorrect. Try turning only one. So did we do, okay. Let's do this, this, that, to that. Yeah, I'm not colorblind, am I? Oh my god. <laughs> okay, try turning both. We'll do both again. Even though I just did that. Unless you're supposed to do it in a specific order. Like, top to bottom instead of bottom to top. End. <clears throat> okay, now we'll do it from bottom to top. Okay, here we go. <laughs> We're gonna break this thing, dude. Okay. Bend. They want you to go from bottom to top. Oh my God. Whoever wrote these instructions with their coloring book. Terrible job. Okay. Let's bring our items back to the damn van. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Where did that come from? Is that the murdering weapon? Now it does say... To pick up trash and to mark evidence. USB evidence. Uh, I think the ID would be evidence. Apparently that's evidence. What is that? Inhaler? What the hell is that? 
A cigar? A lighter? What in the world? Okay. Evidence. What is this? That's not evidence. What is that? That is a cigarette butt. Okay, that's a cigarette butt. Everything can be evidence? Okay, this is weird. <laughs> um, Numbers are evidence. <laughs> oh. 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 Um. I think the ID would be evidence. Yeah. <laughs> the knife. Wait, when was there a knife? When, wait, when was there a knife? Or is it the pipe? What the hell is going on over here? This thing? This looks like the, the weapon that might have killed this person. Uh, that did not work. Maybe not. It says I have four out of six. Optional. Uh, evidence markers, but I've put down five. There we go. Now that's five. Okay. <laughs> this is so weird, dude. Oh, this is so weird. Okay. Let's go this way. Purse. Evidence? Sure, dude. Okay. Now we have to collect trash. Book? Under the toilet? Is considered trash. I put it in the garbage can. Okay. One out of 20. This cigarette butt? Also? Trash. You were opening lockers, you should have done the, the yeah, like the, the guy from I Am Future. That's funny. Cell phone or the shattered tablet? Trash, not evidence. <laughs> Rubber ducky? You're the one you make bath time look so much fun? You're trash. Vogue Mac. Oh, there's the machete. I thought that was like a sign. I thought this was a sign. Yeah, that's not evidence. <laughs> the potential suspect's weapon of choice. There's no blood on it. Crash. <laughs> this has blood on it. That pipe. The knife didn't. So I, I, I chalk it up as a win. Somebody's Hotmail account, if anybody still uses Hotmail. Crash. Hey, Savvy, thank you for the uh, six months, Savvy Tech. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Hope you're doing well. Calculator that spells boobies. Crash. Um. Time Magazine. Crash. Anything else that's trash? Supersize me? Trash. Mm -hmm. uh, shampoo bottle? Trash. Anybody? I, I know it's like a big thing. Um, And like, I don't know. Anybody going to like one of their like swimming places? Like, I guess you could like argue like the YMCA. This is what a bottle of bourbon? Or maybe shampoo. Um, and then like there's like public showers and stuff like that. Like who's doing the public shower thing? Like sorry. That's, I'm not. See I. Let alone public pool. People are doing the public shower thing. But that's like normal. In some countries. Like no problem. Hold my beer. It, like they had that in high school and stuff like that. But even then in high school I was like what the. What, no. What are you doing? Don't take a shower while we're trying to get ready for biology. Like, this is not what I need going into biology. I mean, it's very hands-on scientific scientific stuff I'm seeing here, but I don't... 
No. Stop. Not as I'm about to go dissect a pig. Please. What is this? A candle? Crash. I'm missing three items. It's so damn dark in here. Can I get a flashlight? Can I get a flashlight? What is this? Oh, bottle of shampoo from Costco. <clears throat> Two more items. There we go. <sighs> I was in, if I was in public showers, I wouldn't need to book under the toilet. Wait, I wouldn't, I wait. <laughs> I wouldn't need that book under the toilet. <laughs> I wash my hair after the pool and rinse off in the showers. The chlorine irritates my skin. That's okay. Yeah, I, I, I feel you on that. But even then you could also like be uh, clothed and rinse off. Right? Like you can shower with a, with a bathing suit on still. Right? I 100% I understand that. People are like... No, I'm going all in. And they like treat it like it's their home. <laughs> and they walk around in their birthday suit. Maybe people like the attention. I don't know. I'm looking for one piece of item. One piece of trash, please. The radio. This is too upbeat for a murder. Sorry. Looking for one piece of item. Check all the lockers. Check all the lockers. Am I blind here? I'm about to F it. Or, excuse me, pardon me. I'm about to say F it. I can't find this last piece. I'll have you clean up your own freaking swimming hole here, buddy. I've done enough, I think, for you. I've done enough. I you look, I did it. I did everything I could. Nope, I didn't. Toothbrush. Who's bringing a toothbrush to a shower? Give me the hell out of here. This was the most painstaking one we've done yet. The pool murderer strikes again. Where are the police when we need them? Calm Sunday turned into a nightmare for the neighborhood with a pool near the forest. It's a second pool themed murder in this town and police aren't any closer to solving this terrifying case. How many neighborhoods are endangered? Can we still use them or are we destined to fry in the heat? What are you talking about? Will the police finally work this out and stop this vicious murderer who keeps targeting simple people enjoying water on hot days? I, 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 I think so. Additional task money? We didn't even get money for the additional task? Well, what the heck? School swimming pool. Pressure washer, underwater vacuum cleaner, a wrench. Holy hell. Container of chlorine. Oh my God. I need four of them. Okay. Okay. Hang on a sec. Hey, that goes in there. That goes there. Okay. Two filters. Okay. Landing net. Pressure washer. Obviously. Wide tip. Duh. Landing net. Okay. Door. Vacuum. Wrench. Three more of these. Okay. I think good on that. Okay, that. There we go. Okay. Are we good? I think we're good. Container of chlorine. No, no, no. We're, we're, we're not good. Do I need more? Okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, good. Okay, 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 okay. 
All right, we're going for the school, baby. We're going for the school. All right, here we go. We ready? <sighs> Details. Good morning. Good morning, Dory Bridge. As the new head head headmistress of the school, I am asking you to clean up this wretched swimming pool. Please don't empty it, though. Water has become very expensive. We try to be eco-friendly. Please also replace the filters and clean the area around. Do you think not emptying the pool and putting in new and putting in new water is? She says we're trying to be eco-friendly by not emptying the water. Or by ref not emptying and refilling, but is it not emptying and refilling also not eco-friendly? Anyways, code room for the pump room. One, two, three, four. Kind regards, headmistress Dory Bridge. I accept. I accept. Let's go. Yeah. Uh, wow. Collect trash from the pool? At least it's not a murder scene. Okay. That's where our van is. Okay. Wait a sec, this is a school, huh? <clears throat> I never swam in our school's pool. Even when we were given the option to, I said pass. So, I think this is all a me problem now, isn't it? So, they don't want us... Okay, turn that off. They don't want us to... How are we going to do this? They don't want us to empty the water. Okay, so collect the trash from the pool. Okay, we need to get the landing net. Let's get that first. First and foremost, give me that bad boy. Perfect. We get to use the um, the vacuum for the first time too. That. Okay. Right. Go. Cool. Yep. Okay. That duck is a son of a gun. What the heck is that, dude? All right. Somebody lost their shorts in the pool. <laughs> How do you lose your shorts in the pool? I know it's like a funny like meme thing, like in 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 movies where like oh the the child jumps into the pool and loses his shorts or something because he's trying to hit on the lifeguard or something rather. Or was that like Sandlot only? I can't remember if he loses his shorts. Maybe not. Who loses their shorts in a movie that I'm thinking of? I think it's a Sandlot. No, maybe not. Oh, it's a Little Rascals? Maybe it's the Little Rascals. I might be thinking of the Little Rascals. Get that freaking thing out of there. I wonder if I could actually get the uh, vacuum in there. How does that work? Yeah. There we go. Do I just throw it in? To start using underwater vacuum pool cleaner to get to the corner of the pool. To end the underwater vacuum cleaner, get back to the same corner. Oh, I see. Okay. Oh. Wait, I have to operate it? Oh my god. But what if I don't want to operate it? <laughs> These things are like automatic mostly, right? Don't they do their own thing in real life? Like, we don't control it. What in the world? I don't know about this, dude. These things usually go by themselves. <clears throat> so many movies where they lose their shorts? That's true. I need to get the net to throw away these, op these optional trash. I need to pick up all the trash again. What the heck? Is I guess this is not needed right now. Usually these things are automatic. I think I'm screwed on the duck. <laughs> My school was an overcrowded one. One story building with no pool. Here we go. Okay, get me out of here. Okay, thank you. But no thank you. <gasps> Wait, how do I get it? Uh oh. Oh no. Okay. All right. So let's re pick up the items that I 
put out of the pool and throw them away or wait in the bucket no trash can where's the trash can at i guess i should probably go inside the the room too huh i haven't gotten in there yet i don't even know where there is a trash can who this is ridiculous man there we go trash can try again Ray, that's one out of seven <laughs> Okay. Let's do this. Thank you. Floaters are in here, right? Yeah, there's a bunch of floaters. Okay. They don't want us to change that. How? Okay, so what do they... Do they even want us to touch this? Probably not, huh? Yeah, they don't want us to touch that at all. Okay, clean it up. Now I got to remember exactly everything that I pulled out of the... Uh, out of the... Uh, out of the pool here, maybe. Unless they count any of this trash. Let's see. If I count this and then just throw it in, will that count? I hate that the trash can is so far away. No. It's just regular trash. Okay, so I got to get the trash specifically from the pool. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm, I don't remember what I pulled out of here. Did I pull that out? I don't know. I definitely pulled that out. Oh, God. Definitely pulled out the shorts. What's down there? What the heck is this? Is this like a kiddie pool? Oh, no. This is where the showers are. Go shower outside. Very well. Yeah, I guess it... Uh-oh. I don't know where it went. Okay. You know what? Pick up every single trash. There we go. Some of this stuff can't even be picked up without this. Okay, that's what the pool ones are. The pool ones are the ones you can't pick up by hand. All right, very well. Here we go. Three out of seven. Okay. Like this. This is going to take a hot minute, isn't it? Oh, yo, yo. This is one way to freaking prolong the gameplay now, isn't it? Here we are. Guess, I guess if we just pick up everything, it'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Pick up the trash, but you can't pick it up when you don't. When then you know it was from the pool and it need the net. Yeah. Okay. That car actually moving? Oh, no. I thought there was a car moving. Don't throw away the boards. Wait a sec. Don't throw away the boards. Uh-oh. Collect the swimming boards. Frick me. Okay. Good call. Good call. What is that, dude? Okay, that's nothing. Collect the boards. <laughs> okay. Water jug? Water cooler? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Can I just bring the trash can with me? I don't know if I need it. I don't know if that actually changed anything when I put that in there. There we go. Oh, don't drop that in the pool. Whatever you do. Okay. Such a long walk, man. There's shutters for the outdoor showers. Is that right? Where's the shutters? Oh. Oh. There needs to be shutters, maybe. Well, I mean, I don't know. I think, again, that's like a whole... That's like a whole thing where, like... You just rinse off with your bathing suit on. Kind of like if you go to like to the beach. You go to the beach and you see like there's a there's a bunch of showers out in the parking lot, you know? Just hose off. That always felt good. I don't know. One of the hardest things though about going to the beach is trying to keep your feet not sandy and getting into the car. That's the hardest thing about going to the beach. You go to the beach. And you're like, okay, I don't want to get sand in my car. How do you prevent that? Well, simply you have to like have a water bottle on you or a bucket of water. And then as soon as you get into the car, keep your feet out and then just like dump water on your feet. So hard, such a hassle. Oh, 
Go and drop that in the pool. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh. Can you get the boards out of the trash? Good question. Would a shoe be considered uh, trash? Probably. I hate the feeling of like sand in between your like toenails. You know what I mean? Oh, what a terrible, terrible feeling. I can't jump in this game, unfortunately. Is that a shutter? Or is that a shutter? Is that a board? Can't tell. Uh, being very thorough in my look here. Am I, though? Uh, right. I guess I could collect the shoes, too. Anything back here, yeah? Boards. It doesn't say like an actual number of swimming boards either. It just says collect the boards. I don't know how I'm going to get that freaking duck out of there, dude. <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know what other trash there is in here either. Unless I missed something. Now there was there was like this like that thing right there. That's what I'm looking for. It was this thing. I know this like like swimming hat thing. Yeah. Jump in and grab it. That would be awesome. Two more. Mm -hmm. Anything in here? Maybe no. I guess in there is what the heck. I guess inside of the room is where I'm going to collect all the swimming boards. Or maybe I put them in the bucket. Maybe I put them in the bucket. I feel like I want to... Is there like a way... No, I was going to say, is there like a way to restart this level? Okay. Well, well, I don't know. It's hard to collect the trash when you can't see the trash. I'm not sure, dude. Mm -mm -mm. I don't see any trash in there and it probably is i probably got all of it if not some of it but this not being able to i guess that's not trash maybe that's not okay let's see let's try to organize a little bit more here let's go to oh let's go to uh how do we do this boards i guess and then we collect the boards and put them in the bucket, maybe? Let's see. I was thinking this thing, man. No? No. I don't know where to collect the boards. Maybe in the room. Oh, wait. Maybe in here. <laughs> I don't know, dude. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know. Collect the swimming boards. <laughs> I feel like I should try. Yeah. I feel like I should try to restart it. Let's restart it. Let's see. I want to restart that. See if that's possible. Okay. Go like that. Go like that. Go like that. Like that. Like that. And like that. Okay. Good. 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 I'm sorry, I cannot accept this offer. Do I have everything? I guess I don't have the landing net. Okay. There we go. Let's go. The boards go in the bottom corner. In the bottom corner. The bottom corner of what? Okay. Here we go. Don't mess. Hey, don't mess with the trash you get out of here. Okay, first things first, grab the trash. 
dump it. Okay, one out of seven. You love to see it. Magazine me. Jennifer Aniston's on the cover. She has no children. But she's still a beautiful woman. Okay, two out of seven. Okay, can't get the duck. I guess the duck stays. Grab that. One thing at a time. Oh, shit. Did that count? I don't know if it did. By the way, thanks for subscribing, Laura. Appreciate it. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. So finicky, man. Okay. Alright. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Come on. Come on. Ah. Oh my god. Just so you know, this game comes out in like a day. And I will say that I probably maybe most likely have a early build. Did that not work either? <gasps> oh, that better have worked. I don't know if that worked either. Did that make it in? I really hope it's I have a have an early build for this game. Um there's some weird things going on in this game, I tell you. I'll be real with you. Okay. I... I... I don't want to start over again. I really don't. I... I, I just can't. <laughs> I don't even... Okay, so... It would be this bottle, right? I think this bottle... And then this duck... These two would have to be the last trash. Like two out of, like seven out of seven trash. Can you crouch? Good shout. don't understand dude i don't get it everything else is non-crouchable those two objects are crouchable right okay <clears throat> fill the floater yeah but let's do that let's fill the floater shall we let's do that yep can you not drain? No, the the this mission in particular is asking us not to drain the uh, water because they want to be eco friendly. Apparently, one, two, three, four. Okay, go fill the floaters. I don't know how many how much this takes though. Uh, there's four. So maybe I go five each. By the way, thanks for subscribing, Kyle. I'll go five each. Yeah. Seems reasonable. It seems like a lot, though. I'll be real with you. Okay, that didn't take five, I don't think. That only took two. What the frick is happening? Okay. Some of them took five, some of them took three, some of them took two. Okay. Put it in there. There we go. 
Okay. Put that over there. This game is so strange. It's not very consistent now, is it? There we go. I don't know. How, I, 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 if I were to assume, I would assume this game will be like 1499 USD. That's my assumption. Okay. Place it right there. Okay. Was that enough or was that not enough? Did I not do enough? Maybe I didn't fill enough. Okay. I filled enough. All right. Very good. Put the floater in the pool. No, no, no. We've already done that. Okay. Do I have to re-put them in? Okay. Clean the bottom of the pool. I got you. Let's get the vacuum. This is so weird. Let's go. Okay. Again, in real life, this would just... Oh, God. This would just run on its own. But I guess I have to do it. Interesting. Interesting take here. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'm going to be here for a hot minute now, am I? <clears throat> How can you not drain it? It looks like a sewage. I agree. <laughs> I have more than 100,000 weed storage, but now I kind of regret having this much weed. It's not going down. It's taken forever. <laughs> what? <laughs> Corners of the pool are gonna suck. Yeah. Hopefully, like this, this game. Oh god. I have to do this entire pool, yeah. I was hoping this would have been uh, been automatic, but that's you know, I guess prolonging gameplay there. Sure, dude. Unscrew the screws to get to the filters, it says as well. Hopefully, if I get the majority of the pool, the rest of the pool will, pool will automatically be cleaned. That's my idea here. Yeah. Vacuum lines, that's, that's what makes vacuuming deep carpet so satisfying. It's true. I do like, I do like vacuuming in real life. Like, if somebody said, hey, can you vacuum the house? I'd be like, yeah, sure, dude. I like it. I find it kind of therapeutic in a way. I don't know. I like the, uh... I like the look of the carpet when it's vacuumed. I like the... I know it's, like, the... I don't know how to describe it. What is it? Like, the smell? The freshness smell of, of a vacuumed carpet or something, rather? I don't know how to explain it. Maybe you know what I'm talking about. Very satisfying. I hate carpets. I have to shampoo mine mine Thursday. Oh, very well. I think we shampooed ours, I think, <clears throat> a couple of days ago, actually. It will clean itself because that's what happened in the previous scenarios. <laughs> You missed a spot? Oh, I missed a lot of spots. Yeah, I'm going to try to get the majority. I'll come back and get the other spots, but... Hopefully, the majority will automatically clean it. We'll have to see. Doubtful after the diving board experience. Vacuuming the carpet, then knowing that you have a nice clean carpet to lay on. Well, okay. That and like emptying, emptying, emptying the, uh, the, the, the vacuum, you know, when it's like, okay, time to empty the vacuum. And you're like, wow, I'm actually filthy <laughs> or wow. I have filthy animals. <laughs> Holy crap. You're telling me I vacuumed up that in my house? What the heck? 
I didn't put it there. <laughs> no, sir, that was not mine. That's not mine. The majority of our house is like tile, like wood. But we do have two rooms where it's carpet. I have carpet in the room I'm sitting in right now. I really prefer to make content and stuff like that in a carpeted room than a hardwood room. So eventually when I move out of this place, hopefully that's sooner rather than later. Um, I got to dedicate it, dedicate myself to having another room that's make sure it's carpeted and not hard tile, even though I do like hard tile. But hard tile is, I think hard tile is harder to clean or keep clean compared to carpet. Like you have to clean tile or wood or panel. I forgot what the name of it is. Um, you, have to, you have to clean that a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Carpet in the living room, vinyl in the rest of the house. I got a shark. I just push a button and uh, voila, done for me. That's right. The little shark uh, with the, the automatic vacuums, right? Little, little auto vacuums. Do those things ever like run into your feet or anything like that? Like, hey, beep, beep, coming through. Did they ever like take you out? <laughs> Hey, Riley, how are you, Riley? Mm -hmm. Get to take scissors to my vacuum once a month to get the tangled hair out. Exactly. I feel ya. I feel ya. Is that an underwater vacuum? It is. It is. Some of this game is a bit tedious. Yeah, I think that's, I think that's the point of it. I think that's the point of it. Um, I think that's the tedious stuff is what prolongs the gameplay. Kind of like this exactly to make it, to make it kind of mask the feeling that you are playing a game longer than you really are. If that makes any sense. It's a kind of a thing where it's like, this is one of those tedious task jobs where it's like, oh yeah, uh, you know, this will up your hours in gameplay with this game. And some people, we, you know, we talk about it where it's like you get a dollar value per hour on game. Like, for instance, if you get if you get a $60 game, you should be able to get 60 hours out of it. If you get a $10 game, you should get 10 hours out of it. I think this is one of those scenarios where it's like, here, let me just kind of cheat my hour way in. Because, like, in real life, these things go automatically. And you would just stick them in the pool and they would do their own thing. But for some reason in this game, it's not like that. You have to control it. Mm -hmm. uh, dun -dun 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 -dun. My vacuum can switch between carpet and hard floors. That's really cool. Is the carpet for soundproofing... And so Bella Mercy don't slip. Uh, the carpet is just for, uh, yeah, sound in here when I'm streaming. It's mostly sound for when I'm streaming. But if I was in a hardwood or a tile room, it would be very echoey in here because the sound would bounce off the floors and bounce off the walls. It already is kind of echoey in here. The sound in this is not as good as I would like it to be, but, um, I mean, it's better than being in hardwood right now. <laughs> yeah, and this probably has like some sort of satisfaction to it. Power wash simulator, you know, cleaning and all that and being able to get every little inch, right? Will I be doing a stream for House Flipper 2? 
before the release on the 14th that is totally up to frozen district if they're gonna supply me with an early key early copy of the game if they let me and there's no embargo then i will do a early stream of house flipper 2 but that's totally up to them and if i get a key and all that stuff i did however get an early key and early access and we will have early streams on an upcoming title here this month so that was good news i got news about that yesterday if anybody is interested in paleo pines i will be streaming paleo pines like i think two weeks early i think is what they're giving us they're giving us two weeks early access to it <laughs> you got the key for paleo pines too yeah there you go very good so yeah so we we, we should be streaming that i think in the middle of september if on pc at least for consoles it's a little bit later but for pc the pc build will be able to stream a couple weeks early only up to a certain point we'll be streaming we'll be able to stream too though <laughs> i need to start saving for either a laptop or a steam deck or a new xbox so many games i want to play i can't <laughs> it all depends what kind of games you want to play um if it's like console games that really cut catch your eye or is it like pc games that really catch your eye mm -hmm. are we nearly at the end of the pool yet great question looks like we're just halfway <laughs> halfway maybe <laughs> Oh God, help me, Lord. Ah! I can't remember if we can name our dinos. If we can, by release, I am calling it Penguin. Um, I know in the first, uh, when we played the demo, I think the first dino was already named. But I would assume maybe if you got other dinos, you would be able to name them. I have three weenies, Bubba, Abby, and Heidi. And I and I have vacuum daily, but once a month I slow vacuum and I'm amazed what comes up. I have a vacuum mop for hard floors. And you know, Bella just she just had uh, she just got a haircut a couple of days ago. And when we took her to the groomers, she it was raining outside. It was like a bad rainstorm this last weekend. Or so or like a couple of this weekend actually and so it was raining hard outside and so i took her to the groomers and she's a long hair weenie weenie and so when she her hair gets all wet she gets like really curly hair and so the groomers were like oh my god i've never seen a curly hair dachshund before like well she's just a really frizzy right now <laughs> you just caught her in the frizz Caught her in the frizz. Are you sure you're making any progress? You seem to be in the same place in the pool. I think so. I don't know. <laughs> now I'm nervous. See, I joined for the exciting part. <laughs> I don't know why they're making us do this. This is ridiculous. Bella wants the same perm as her owner. That's true. She actually got a new bed this weekend, too. She's been spoiled. She got all in one day. Oh, God. All in one day, she got her hair done. She got her nails done. She got 
a massive, just a gigantic Costco Kirkland bed. And then she also got a massive dinosaur toy from Costco as well. And she loves her giant dinosaur. I think it's, oh wait, maybe it's not a dinosaur. Maybe it's a giant dragon. I think she has a dragon. She loves that freaking dragon. And it's like a bed. It's a bed where she, it's like a bed made for like a, a Labrador, like a, it's like a bed made for like a Rottweiler, like a massive bed. But we bought it because it was on sale and Bella lives the bougie life. So she has a massive bed. So now she has like, she has two beds. She has a bed in my room. She has the massive bed in the living room. She has a couch in the hallway. And then she has my bed because my bed is considered her bed. <laughs> and yes, I'm serious. She has a couch. She has her own personal couch. And it's in the living room. Or sorry, it's in the hallway. Her own personal couch is so adorable. When she sits in it or sleeps in it. You know how like you're on the couch and you like put your arm on the shoulder of the couch. You know how you're like hanging out. That's exactly what she does. She sits, puts her arm on the shoulder, and she just hangs out. A good dog. A very good dog. <laughs> yeah, king size bed. She's a star, so she deserves it. That's very true. Those little dog couches are so cute. They are. They are. They're expensive, but man, they're worth it. Like, the whole point of it was the, like, I would have more room on my couch, so she would have her own couch. But that's not what happens. I sit on my couch. She sits on the couch as well. When I'm not sitting on my couch, she then sits in her couch. She's a couch stealer. Yeah. Why is Bella living better than me? Exactly. <laughs> oh my God. She's asleep right now, right next to me in her bed. She usually just lays in here and listens to me streams and falls asleep to it. I want to, I want to really want a little dog couch for my 17 year old cat. You know, it's funny, we actually, you know, those little cat huts, those little cat forts where like, they're like enclosures for cats. We bought one because we were going to be like, okay, maybe Mercy will like this. No. Years ago, we bought one. It was supposed to be Mercy's. Mercy was terrified. She didn't want to. Wow. We did it. <laughs> she didn't want to get in it. And so instead, Bella's big chunky ass got into it and she could barely fit in it. But it was adorable when she was in the little cat hut. We like to experiment with different beds and different toys in this house. Yeah. Hey, there we go. We did it. We got the majority and the majority cleaned the rest of the pool for us. So thank God for that. Holy crap. <laughs> that was crazy. Okay, so unscrew the screws to get the filters. This must be it. Give me my screw first. There we go. Okay, here we go. Thank you. How do you get your vacuum back? Honestly, at this point, just donate it to the school. <laughs> yeah, here. You want a vacuum? I don't need it anymore. Okay, filter. Oh, wait. That's right. We need filters now. Okay. We'll put this back in the van. So I don't lose it. There we go. Perfect. Okay. All right. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. In. 
Okay, this is a dirty one. I have to get another one, yeah? Let me go get another one. I think this is a dirty one, yeah? It's black. Uh, no. Uh, okay, maybe not? Try it. Uh, okay. Let's try this again, shall we? Nope. Okay, that's better. All right, very well. We got it. Perfect. I gotta make sure I put these filters back too, yeah. 80% of your house is clean and the rest cleans on its own. That'd be funny. <laughs> Sorry, Neil says, Kaz, just wanted to say thanks for all your hard work. I am playing tons of Dinkum and started watching all your Dinkum series and on 10. Wow. That's awesome to hear. Enjoy that because there's a lot of content there. There's a lot of hours in that Dinkum series. I hope you enjoy that, but thank you for the kind words. I appreciate that. Okay, now let's clean the outside. Let's do it. Let's do it, baby. I'll do the trash last. I'll do the trash last. You have to start this level again. I'm going for a coffee. I need a coffee. That'd be real nice right now, honestly. I think that's one of the hardest things about trying to get over being sick. Is like pacing myself. It's kind of why I'm playing this game today. I kind of mentioned at the beginning of the stream today. Is like I needed to find a game where I could just not put a lot, a lot of effort into. So that I could kind of ease back into it. I think one of the hardest things about being sick this last like week and a half is um, just energy, dude. Like my energy has been like non-existent, you know, it's definitely kicked my butt. Now, I've had COVID before and this was my second time getting COVID, but this second time getting COVID was a lot worse than the first time getting COVID. Uh, the first time I got COVID, I was obviously doing YouTube also. And I was only gone for like maybe five days. This second time getting COVID, I was gone for a long while. And then on top of that, other stuff happened in my life that was just unexpected and things like that. But I think, like I said, the one thing that was, that is, <laughs> it was hard is like trying to get my energy back. So I started with like making some regular videos, right? Before I started streaming so that. I could see how long I could last. Ding. Is this Starfield? Yes, this is Starfield. Have I had my COVID jab? I have not. <coughs> I think Danielle's had a couple vaccines. But I have not have a vaccine before. My husband and I have COVID right now. Our first time. It sucks. So happy to have my petite to snuggle all day while my energy is so low. Okay, you're feeling the effects of energy being low as well, huh? Yeah. Yeah, it's a weird thing. It's a weird, weird, weird situation going on. Especially uh, with like Danielle's work and all that. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, there's a little bit of dirtiness right there. Whoops. <laughs> My dad and sister got COVID and I survived not getting it. Hopefully I never get it. Yeah, don't get that. It's nasty stuff. Nasty stuff indeed. Not to mess around with that. There we go. 
Yeah. They said, uh, bottom right for boogie boards or boards, right? Is it in that thing over there? Maybe. That over there, right? Over here? Boards, maybe? Possibly? Mm hmm. Yeah, I think Danielle found out that she was anemic, I think, uh, a couple weeks ago. I think she got her, she got blood tests back, and I think she said that she, she's anemic, which she did not know. Oh my goodness. Goodness gracious. Boom. I work at a school and today was the first day. They won't let me come to work until next week. Yeah, see, that's the thing is, uh, that's the thing. So there was a big COVID outbreak at Danielle's work, which look, I stream, make content. All, I don't leave the house ever. <laughs> Right? I never leave that. Like, 90% of my life is in this house. So, how would I get COVID, right? It came from Danielle's work. There was an outbreak at Danielle's work. And so, when that happened, a bunch of people got it and got sick. She got sick first. I took care of her. Then I got sick from her. And um, what happens is, is that since the our state is not in a state of emergency, they had to send her home and she was not allowed to come to work for 10 days and there's no covid relief like there's no covid sick pay uh, but you're not allowed to come to work for 10 days but you don't get paid for being sick at the same time so it's like a really weird tricky situation it's very very odd very odd indeed Okay, that's the chlorine tabs. Let's put the chlorine tabs back. Go mm, 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 mm. here. 18 out of 20. Okay. I don't think we need the power washer anymore. Wait, clean stains around the pool. Yeah, I guess we do. I don't think there's anything back here, though. The Corona is back or are we talking 2020? No, the COVID will always be around. It will always be around. It'll just be in different variants. Just like, just like most of a, like any other flu. There's every year. That's why every year you get a flu, a seasonal flu shot. It's because there's always different variants of a flu. It always mutates. I don't know where these other stains are and I don't know where this other trash is either who freaking knows at this point hang on a sec Okay. Can I at least collect these swimming boards? Clean the stains around the pool. Goodness gracious. This is going to be one of those things, isn't it? <laughs> oh, man. No! It's going to be one of those things where you have to, like, hopefully get lucky. The sinks could use a washing. Yeah, I think that's. I don't know if they count. I did try to spray them, but I'll try it again. Is 
Is there a highlighter option like in Power Wash? No, there isn't. Which really grinds my gears. And those sinks are pretty nasty. Those sinks are pretty nasty. Sometimes in these games they have like a hint button, but I don't think that that's even a thing. Yeah. Sure, dude. I just... <laughs> I did it. I did something. I don't know what I did, but I did it. And I did it damn good. Been playing Boulder's Gate 3. Oh, that comes out tomorrow on PlayStation. Comes out tomorrow on PlayStation, and then I think eventually it comes out on Xbox. So if you are a PlayStation person and you've been waiting for Boulder's Gate, watch out now. There's a highlighter, but in later jobs. Interesting. Okay. Interesting. I wonder if there's like how many other later jobs there are in this game. I do like the power wash simulator. Um, I do like the highlighter in that game. That game, that game does it right. You know, that game does it right. Maybe what I need to do is like Okay Just do it correctly, I guess forehead Yeah, I was thinking maybe I need to just move all the boards Let that be it mm -hmm. Also ask for two more trash too I haven't seen any trash, but maybe I missed looking it I'm going very slow, very thorough. Mm -hmm. You like Power Wash Sim? Did they ever, I can't remember if they released the, the SpongeBob one or if they didn't. A game like that and even having like um, co-op. I think that's pretty good. Could be on the walls, huh? Yeah, it could be on the on the side walls. Let's do the side walls here. Go around. Oh my god, dude, this is painful. I'll be real with you. Okay, so it was released. Okay, I wasn't sure if it was coming out soon or if it was released yet. Go! Go! Be good to me! Be good to me! Please be it. If not, then I'm going to have to move the boards or something. Oh, shit. Okay. Let's move the boards. It's say about collecting the boards and putting them over here. Is this where I should collect them? I don't know where to put the boards. Here? Maybe? Possibly? Oh, frick. <laughs> I'm gonna make another mess. Oh, no. <laughs> no! 
The other corner? Over there? Or over there? Can't be that corner. Can't be that corner, so I'm assuming that corner. Yeah. It was there a green light? The green light will be there if you look while holding it. Oh, I see. Holy crap. Wait a sec. Oh my god. This is so weird. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, this is actually terrible. Okay, okay. I, I understand. I get it. But how weird. Okay. Okay. All right. I see. I see. All right. I see. It's going to make like some sort of design. I, I feel you. I think. I don't know. What a weird thing. There we go. This. go grab all the boards i don't even know like what i guess this these boards would be like for teaching someone how to swim i guess huh hmm. Mm -hmm. the spongebob dlc has been out a while they just announced back to the future what they announced back to the future dlc that's pretty cool if any, like, devs have done it right, they have done it right. Especially, like, um, being able to get, like, all these different licenses to do different things as well. Back to the Future, that's pretty cool. <laughs> any more boards back here? Crash? No? Hmm. <laughs> Any boards in here? Any trash in here? A boards. Go. Make it a card at a house at a card house out of with floaties. Exactly. Uh oh. There we go. I don't think that would work. I don't know. I'm being too I'm being too nitpicky. I'm like, I don't think that would work in real life. Oops. Just like the search for the rubber duckies in the demo. That's right. We did the search of the rubber duckies today. I love it. I don't know why. I just love it. It just feels like an Easter egg hunt, and I and I just adore it. I just adore Easter egg hunts for some reason. Like even in Stardew Valley, like that was that was fun. I liked being able to do that. Mm -hmm. Oh, was there trash under the lifeguard tower? This one right here, or is there another lifeguard tower oh, over there? I'm not sure what this is. I guess it's like a... I, I don't know if this is like a weight thing to like sink to the bottom of the pool. I have no idea what that is. Here we go. Those boards are usually just chilling in a bin somewhere. This is a lot of work. <laughs> <laughs> I don't they get all wet and they get all nasty. Oh, come on. You know what I'm doing. Come on. Come on. Perfect. Let's see. Let's see. One over here. Yeah. You got to spray off this. This. I. Okay. So like the murder pool was a pain but i feel like this is more of a pain 
What's in here? This one's way more of a pain than the murder one. Hey, Thanks for subscribing there, uh, Hibrius? 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 Hey, Kyla, how you, how's it going? What's going on? Oh my goodness gracious, there's so many boards right here. Is that a pink board in the in the room? I think it was a pink outfit. Or no, it was a pink towel. Pink towel. There's one towel out of like I guess somebody left the towel. Go. This must be the top part, finishing part of it. Let's see. Reminds me of when a teacher would give us boards and there were teeth marks in it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. True. True, true, true. Very true. Very true. And you're like, oh, I don't want to mess with this, kind of. I wonder if I can get that shoe. You would think that shoe would be trash. Okay. Okay. So, I guess the best part that we could do is, again, kind of, like, run through this. Okay, so we've completed that. <laughs> now they want us to bring the tools back to the, to the, to the, to the van. Very well. There we go. Good job, we did it. At least that. Land net. Hey, James, thank you for the 18 months of support. I appreciate that, James. Thank you very, very much. Hope you're doing well, yeah? That's very kind. You're almost at two full freaking years. Two full freaking years. I don't know how the heck I'm going to finish this off. Where could the last swimming board be hiding? Exactly. Where could the last two pieces of trash be hiding? Where could be... Oh. Hooray! <laughs> where could my tools be hiding? Um. But yeah, where's the last two pieces of trash hiding? And where's my tools hiding now? Um. Did I leave any tools in here? Um, okay. <laughs> no. No. This place looks clean enough. You think they let us go? They won't let us go. Oh, shoot, dude. What is missing? What are we missing? Oh, I guess we're missing this, huh? That's right. We're missing this. Can't forget about the vacuum. And then I don't know. Will they let us go if we don't get all the trash? 99%? They won't let us go unless we get the two pieces of trash. Crouch. No? <laughs> I tried the crouch method. How about we crouch on this? Oh no, dude. How are we going to find this trash? I have no idea. <laughs> oh my gosh. I think I'm screwed. I think I am. I think I am. Do the two dirty filters count towards trash? Uh, no, I think they count towards... Um, Putting back uh, your your uh, your tools in a way, yeah. Tiberius says hello there, everyone. I've been pretty much spent the past few weeks binge watching the entire channel. I only realized I had not subscribed when I viewed this stream, so that's rectified now. I appreciate that. Thank you for subscribing and thank you for checking out the channel. I appreciate it. Mm -mm -mm. It's a shame you can't highlight the trash. Yeah, I don't know what the... What is going on here with the trash? Yeah, that's not trash. I don't know how... It's like finding a needle in a haystack here. Oh, I, know, I don't know. 
Unless, like, maybe there were things that were, I don't know. I'm really not sure. And they won't let us go, huh? They won't let us complete this until we get the trash, which is, that's terrible because I've done so much for y'all. I've done so much for y'all here. nothing hey nothing i mean i don't know how 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 much more i need to I, I, like i don't know how much more i can i can look into this i mean if it was trash it would stand out i'm pretty sure it would i'm not sure dude I really don't want to fail this now that we've gotten this far this far into it. Okay. I always think that's like a piece of paper there. I don't know. You bet it's the filters. Let's see. Can we pull them out? Oh shit. I mean, I put it in the trash can, but it didn't do anything. Yeah. Maybe get the net and try to get the shoe. Good shout. I don't know, dude. Uh. This is a hell of a thing. Can you come clean my pool? You don't have a pool. What are you talking about? Ninety-nine percent. You're not gonna leave me on ninety-nine percent. Game. I'm telling you. I'm promising you 99% I don't think so I don't think so this is this game is evil I agree I did the high radio highlight so I could turn it off <laughs> What about in here? Can I take this stuff? I'm lost. I don't know. I see. Wait, 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 wait. That's the most blended in trash I've ever seen in my entire life. Get me the hell out of here. For your help in the build for your help in building a wonderful plank pyramid, we would like to present you with a certificate of appreciation. Class 11B. <laughs> This is not placed right. <laughs> that was so painful and it's the aqua park scares the crap out of me. <laughs> oh God. <clears throat> A container of chlorine. Okay. Oh my gosh. I don't even know what I need. I'm just throwing stuff in the van at this point, dude. Two filters. <laughs> it 
This scares me. Details. Hello and welcome. This is Andreas Watterson. I am the manager of the newly created water park in a folly. Or not folly. We are planning to open the first part of the park. However, we have small problems. By my mean brother dropped me a crocodile from his zoo. He's sitting in the slide and can't chase him away. I'm counting on your help. You finally have the right equipment. I would also like you to clean all three pools and the area around them. On the left side of the entrance, there is a room with pumps. You do not have to drain the water from the sports swimming pool. Kind regards, manager Andreas Watterson. You're telling me there's a crocodile? I'm not a fan of the crocodile. Bolly Joe with the nine months. Nine months with the best let it go for not being pregnant. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Thank you for the nine months of support. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Since when are we at? Yeah. When are we an animal handler? So you got to clean my pool, but also you have to get this crocodile. Oh my God. Empty the pool, clean the pool, fill the pool. Oh, this is kind of cool, though. Wait a sec. Empty the pool? Wait a sec. Wait a sec. Empty the pool. Wait. They said not... Oh, God. They said not the sports pool. I think that's the sports pool. Clean water stains with sponge. Okay. That's the main pool, sports pool, pool, and jacuzzi. Okay, jacuzzi. Empty the pool, clean the pool, fill the pool. Very well. I think we should start with the jacuzzi. That's one thing we should start with. There's upstairs. I beg your pardon? Wait, which tunnel did they say? Wait, was it the left one or the right one? They said there's a crocodile. Oh my god. Where is this taking me? This is like a... Th I'm in McDonald's now. This is when you're hiding from your parents. They're like, come down. Your six pieces waiting for you, honey. And you come and look out the window. And you're like, ha ha. You're a big adult. You can't get me. And then little did you know, your parents actually went up in there and they got you. And you were actually terrified. You're running from them. You know, in the tunnels. Okay, very well. Jacuzzi. Let's do jacuzzi first. Jacuzzi first. Okay, jacuzzi. How do we... How the hell do we do this? Is this a reference I don't know about? Okay. Water. Jacuzzi. Uh, sir, is there like a manual to this? Uh... Wait a sec. I'm so confused. Okay. Did you tell us how to do this? Area around the left side. Okay, wait. Left side canal. How do you... How do you... Maybe you don't drain it? Empty the pool. No, you definitely drain it. I don't know how the heck you would drain that. I... Yeah. <clears throat> well, I guess we could start with this. This looks like uh, the pretzel pizza you would get at Little Caesars. You know, that like freaking yellow gold. Maybe get rid of the floaties first. This seems jam packed, dude. Clean the pool, change filter, fill the pool. Okay, I can do that. Let's take the floaties out first. Out of here. Oh, I'm a big fan of this floaty. This is like the floaty where like you shoot the ball into. I I I like that. That's a that's a good floaty. Anybody ever got like the big floaties that have like an ice chest built in? Those are good floaties too. Those are floaties you take to the lake though. Like they're like this size but like bigger and they have like built-in ice chests. They fit like 6 or 7 people in the floaty. 
those are those are floaties you take to the uh to the to the lake 100 percent i like the lake i think i like the lake more than the than the you know the community pool even though the lake is technically dirtier okay put on my wide tip and there's fish in the lake but i don't know it just hits different dude i'm craving cheesy breadsticks <laughs> <laughs> it said the sports jacuzzi doesn't need to be drained i thought it said the sports pool didn't need to be drained this one right yeah this one's clean the pool and change the filter does this need to be clean though the heck is going on here What's going on here You can barely see that it's dirty, but it is dirty. <laughs> I finally catching another live. It's been forever. I missed everyone. Hello, Mystic Moonstone. How are you? A floaty with its own bar. Yeah, dude, those floaties are cool. Those floaties are cool, dude. It means more underwatering vacuuming in the sports pool. Oh, you're right about that, huh? Damn it. I didn't think about that. That's a good shout. Can you upgrade your tools? You can. Um, we technically have an upgrade on our power washer right now. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This pool's gonna take forever, I know, right? I like this little bridge, though, even though this bridge makes no damn sense. Why would you cross the bridge, and why would you be on this little island? What's the point of being on this little island here? I will say, though, I know I've said my piece about the community pools and water parks already in today's stream, but I will say, I will say one benefit. Okay, two benefits... Two benefits from uh, water parks. One, obviously snack bar. Two, lazy river. Yeah, lazy lazy river is okay. That that's a hitter. That's a bop right there. I I, I like the lazy river. I'm a fan of it. I be chilling, dude. I just want to sit in the water and just talk nonsense. <laughs> it's basically all I want to do. I just want to sit in the water, have the water push me through whatever, take me where you're going to take me, but then I want to like talk nonsense. Let's just have a conversation about nothing, honestly. I love the lazy rivers. It's the best. I agree. I agree. I had a girlfriend back in the day. This was before Danielle. She was a blonde. And we went to a water park. And I wanted to chill in the lazy river. She wanted to go on things that would flip you upside down. At that moment, I realized, you know what? She might be a little too hot to handle. <laughs> she might be a little too hot to handle. <laughs> this was way before I met Danielle. I will say 
I didn't even know Danielle at the time. I didn't know that eventually a Burnett would come into my life and rock my freaking world. But it happened. It happened. He slid into my DMs on Facebook. Almost. Exactly 12 years ago. September 19th. Actually, sooner than that. Actually, been over 12 years, but September 19th is the day that Danielle and I first officially got together. September 19th, 2011. Been 12 years since then. 12 years since she said, you know what? I don't know who this guy is, but I'm going to slide into his DMs anyways. I didn't know who she was, but she knew who I was. Mm -mm 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 -mm. A girl who likes a lazy river is marriage material. Agreed. <laughs> It's gracious. Mm -hmm. This month we will be celebrating 12 years together. And then this December we'll be celebrating five years of marriage. Five years of marriage. Slid into the DMs and was never seen again. <laughs> oh my gosh, I lost my control input there. I let go of my finger. My finger got numb. I'm just sitting here holding the button, baby. I'm trying to be as thorough as possible because I don't want to be like running around with a mat like a madman again trying to find this one tiny little dirt particle mm. da, 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 da. you know that's all i ever wanted I ever, all i all i ever wanted in life <laughs> all i ever wanted in life was a girl who wanted to who wanted to chill in the lazy river and who wanted to eat some food with me that's that's all i ever wanted dude <laughs> was it that hard to ask nah dude it wasn't i need a girl that likes to eat food because i like to eat food <laughs> Some girls DMs are like a black hole one where neither your you nor light can escape once you cross through the event of the horizon <laughs> I've been married to my wife for 22 years now. Let me hit you with the applause on that one. Yeah. Maybe I should like start with the walls and then work my way with the floors. Maybe that should have been the, the plan of action there. Hey, Tacky Chan. How's it going? Welcome. Good to see you. What's going on? 
35 years married here. Let me hit you with that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Have a good one, Velvet Glove. Do take care. Thanks for hanging out with us. Well, wonderful rest of your night. <laughs> and married for six years. And you know, to be fair, like the girl that wanted to like just ride on a bunch of stuff and wanted to go upside down and left and twisty turny. There was only one way to really just actually describe her. What? Did we just become best friends? No, we did not become best friends. Instead, <laughs> instead. She's the village bicycle. Everyone's had a ride. That's exactly what happened. My grandparents would have celebrated their 79th a few weeks ago. Wow, 79th. That's incredible. That is incredible. 79th. My lord. Valkyriella? Valkyriella? I love the name. It says, I finally caught a live stream, found you through Story of Seasons, then binge every dinkum, and now playing Palea. Oh, very good. Thank you for that. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Thank you for the kind words, and thank you for checking out more of the streams and videos that we have. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hope you're doing well. Absolutely. Single club for 42 years. <laughs> hey, you know, nothing wrong with being single. Right? Nothing wrong with being single. <laughs> being single, most freedom you'll ever have. Most freedom you'll ever have. Most freedom and a time to not have to make any compromises. Compromises. Right? Time to be a little selfish too and that's all right that's okay it's okay to be selfish not all the time let me mind you but it's okay to be selfish <clears throat> some people steer away from the word selfish they don't want to be labeled as that i'll be real with you i'm selfish from time to time but I, you know you also kind of balance it out with some generosity or Balance it out with some compassion and things like that. I'm almost done with the floor. Holy crap. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. <laughs> Hang on, let me take a drink of water. That's right. It's best if you're somewhat selfish early on in a relationship in order to look out for yourself and properly screen the other person. That's true. That is true. <clears throat> I'd rather be selfish than self-centered. Yeah. A lot of, uh, what would you say? How would you say it? Uh... Uh, I guess self-centered does kind of ego egotistical 
falls in the line of self-centered, I guess you could say, yeah? Did I clean this? This is not all clean, no? Oh god, here I go again. I don't know what else I need to clean in this freaking pool. Well, hopefully it's clean enough. This is a weird shaped pool. I will say, I would like to try, like, I don't know. <clears throat> I would like to... I don't know. Maybe not. Never mind. I'm terrifying myself already just by thinking about it. <laughs> yeah, let's put that right there for now. Okay, let's see here. Main pool. If I wanted to change the filter to the main pool, do I just... Okay, do that. Let's get some filters going on. Oh, God. I just... Oh, God. I got it in the nasty pool. Ugh. Or jacuzzi. Filter. Change out the filter real quick. Okay, that's not how you do that. That's exactly how you do that. There we go. Perfect. And then throw it away. Okay, so... I mean, the main pool has been changed. At least filter-wise. I don't think I can actually... Oh, wait. Sports pool. I guess that's another filter that can be changed. Let's change that one, too. I guess I still have to technically clean this pool. Okay. There we are. There we go. I really hope that this is not from the same people that did Power Wash Simulator because if it is, they took a major step backwards. No, it's 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 definitely not. It's definitely not by them. There we go. Okay. I, it's just it, it's basically we have another uh, another inspiration game in a way. I don't know how I'm gonna clean this pool. With not being able to see what the heck I'm looking at here. Oh, okay. Well, I guess that was good. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. It's so, oh, all right. I guess I'm doing it right. I dinged it up. I dinged it. Oh, wait. Diving board, dude. Don't forget the diving board. The diving board will always haunt me. Oh, excuse me. Pardon me. Pardon me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Pardon me. This is the weirdest. What the frick? Why in the world would you have a diving board right here? This is... <laughs> What in the world? What do you dive into, dude? <laughs> okay. <laughs> what the heck? Is that a diving board or is that something else? Am I making things up in my head? That's a diving board, I think. What in the world? I can't even get over there. Okay. I think maybe this is a sponge. Can I, can I, I don't think I brought a sponge, did I? No. Um, what the heck am I going to do? Okay, the island. We've cleaned the side walls of the island. Did I go in the, in the freaking tunnel, maybe? Oh, there we go. Hmm. That's crazy, dude. Let's go to the tunnel. Oh my gosh. Clean water stains with the sponge. I don't have a sponge, dude. You didn't ask me to bring a sponge. Oh no. I really hope this doesn't... I think this is going to tell me to bring a sponge when they... Oh man. Which means I would have to restart this entire thing. No, that's not happening. Sorry, sweetheart. But I don't have a sponge.
This is so weird. Uh, uh, uh. I mean, I I mean the waters, the water pools, puddles outside of the pool makes sense for a sponge, but they didn't tell me to bring a sponge. I didn't bring a sponge. Only the pool, only the floor and the wall with the diving board. Okay, or the left. That's a good shout. Mm -hmm. Hey, Monique, how's it going? Good to see you. This is this right here. You know how long this is? Oh my God, look at this. There's no way. There's no way I'm cleaning this entire thing. There's no effing way I'm going to sit here and clean this freaking thing. No. No. It, no. It's, no. No. Not happening. Sorry. Nope. <laughs> nope. Not unless you give me something else to clean with. Nope. Nope. Ain't happening. Oh. Ah! 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 My lord. <laughs> Nasty. Ew. Ew. It gives me the heebie jeebies, man. How's it going, Dylan? What's going on? Ew. Nasty. I still don't know how to do the water thing in here. Very interesting. Very interesting. Ugh. Can I actually... I guess maybe I could get in there. No, I'm not. I want to see that. I, I want to see it from the front, dude. I see it from the back, but I want to see it from the front. Is that an alligator or is that a crocodile? I don't even know, dude. Ugh. Nasty stuff. So oh, nasty. But I just realized that we just got to the three hour mark. So I think this is where we're going to stop it for now. Um, for pool, what is this called? Pool cleaning simulator. I think we're going to stop it right here for today. Pool cleaning simulator. Um, if you enjoyed this and you want to clean something for yourself, you can go ahead and add it to your wish list on Steam. I do not know the price of it, and I think it actually comes out here very soon. When does it come out? It comes out, oh, it's an early access title that comes out on the 7th of September. So if you are interested in uh, checking out this game or wanting to play this game, uh, add it to your wish list. It's by developed by Ruben Games, Free Mind SA, and Playway SA. Uh, so yeah, I I mean it was cool, but there's there's a lot of work that needs to be put into this. It is going to be an early access game, which suggests to be that there's going to be more stuff added to it later. Obviously, they say they're going to be an early access for one year. I think that's overkill, honestly. <laughs> I think that's overkill. One year they're gonna be in early access for this game. Interesting to see what they're gonna they're gonna do and what they're gonna put for this game. But hey, there it is. If I were to guess price wise, they don't have a price here set. But if I were to guess, my guess would be fourteen ninety nine USD. Yeah. Who knows? I could be wrong about that. But anyway. It's been a pleasure and honor being with you today. Hopefully y'all enjoyed. If you did, please make sure to hit that like button. I'd appreciate it and all that good stuff. Subscribe if you have not already. And if you forgot and maybe you're watching the stream and you're like, I've watched this channel for a while and I have forgot to hit the subscribe button or I have not hit the subscribe button yet. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and all that stuff. You can follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Twitter x.com. Sorry. And all that good stuff. All that good stuff. And uh, I'll be back tomorrow with uh, some more streams and things like that. We've got a lot of different things happening this month. Uh, there's a lot of different games coming out and whatnot that we're going to be taking a look at. Uh, and this was one of them. Um, so yeah, anyways, have a wonderful day. Thank you for the uh, support today. I want to say a special thank you to the Anonymous for tipping $50. 
Zaris for the two dollars sub uh super chat and on andrea for the 50 dollars super chat as well and thank you for the people that subscribed today hopefully you have a wonderful day i did post a video today on tiny witch um if you haven't already check out tiny witch that game is pretty cool it's a minion store um setter upper but it's a little slow in the beginning but it picks up halfway through the video and there's a lot of cool things that you could do in that game there's decorations that you could do to your store you can have pets in that game as well uh, which is really fun and that's all showcased in that video that i put out today so definitely take a look at uh tiny witch uh, because that is a store management driven like game and i think if you like those types of games, you would really enjoy that one for sure. It is a little bit high paced. It's like Diner Dash, but definitely take a look at it if you haven't already. Anyways, I'll talk to you all tomorrow. And it feels good to be streaming again. Yeah. All right. Everyone behave and do take care and all that good stuff. That's right.